Hello adventurers and welcome back to my channel. Today I have something cool planned for you. We have been in the Las Vegas area doing some different kinds of adventures and I actually have something really, really neat that is larger than life. I mean, believe that, larger than life, right? But today I am not alone on this adventure. I am going to be doing this adventure with with Tyson. It's Tyson, guys. So of course there's there's Tyson there. But uh what does that mean? Are Tyson and I on an adventure together by ourselves? Absolutely not. We also have Riley with us. Riley is getting her things taken care of and then we are going to head over to this crazy thing that you guys have to check out. Now, as you first walk in, there are actually two little signs right here that tell you a little bit more about what we are about to go and see. But I'm gonna wait to tell you the story until we get over to where the actual thing happens to be. But just know that this is here. Okay, so it's a little tiny bit of a walk out here. Nothing too crazy, right, Riley? No, not too bad. <sighs> So, are you excited about what you can see ahead of you? I am. I it's am. It's so bright and happy. So behind me is Seven Magic Mountains, and I have been here before. And the first time I was here, I was just in awe because as you're coming down the side road to I-15, you see it in the distance because it's so big. In fact, these rocks are about 35 feet high each. And obviously, in comparison to the rest of the desert, which is super, super flat, super, super brown, these things show up. <laughs> but I have to say this, coming out here today, still super cool. Now we're here on a weekend and during the weekend, of course, it is extra busy out here. Everyone is wanting to come out and take their iconic photos. So you'll see photo shoots happening left and right. I have actually seen bridal portraits here, friend pictures, tourist photos, all sorts of fun things out here at any given time. And because it is open until dusk, you can actually come out here and get sunset photos also, which are fabulous. Go on an Instagram deep dive one day, you'll love it. But let's get a little bit closer to some of these boulders. Now, uh, let me show you how tall each one is. Okay, so Riley's being our height reference real quick. How tall are you, Riley? How tall are you? Five, five. Five, five? Okay, so Riley in comparison to this rock. Here it is, and here she goes. There she is. So that rock is a good almost six feet tall, at least for just the bottom one. And then there's all of these. Wow. Okay, so let's talk about what makes Seven Magic Mountains so special. It was actually created by a Swiss artist and it has been here for several years. So I have a few questions though. Number one, how did they get the rocks way up there? Number two, what made them decide that they wanted to have these stone pillars? Now again, it's super busy out here today, but let me tell you the last couple details before we take one really spectacular look at the display itself. This was actually formed in conjunction with the Nevada Art Museum and has been here since 2016. And at one point in time, they said this was gonna be temporary and then they were gonna come out here and clear it out. But instead they have come back out here and repainted it at least a couple of times. Now. Even though they have repainted it, for some reason, people have taken their liberties with some of the rocks and wrote some not so pleasant messages or just tagged them with their own names, which you're not supposed to do. But I've come to terms with the fact that more often than not, that is the case. So as an advocate for keeping places like this available, I'm just gonna make a public statement. Don't do it.
Now, as we're out here also, there's a few little places that kind of dart off as little paths. So Riley and I are actually gonna be taking a short path just to kind of see what it is, what it looks like, and then also to check out some of these really interesting cacti that are out here, or cactuses. There's an ongoing debate on my channel if it's cacti or cactuses. So you weigh in in the comments below. What do you think it is? parking lot. It is a bit chilly today, but absolutely amazing. And the Seven Magic Mountains did not disappoint. Now, this is about 10 miles outside of the Vegas area. So if you're coming from like the 15 from California side, this is where you'll find it. It is absolutely super, super cool and costs absolutely nothing to see. It is just like a hello and welcome to Vegas moment without necessarily having to stand in line like you do at the Vegas sign. So definitely come and check this out. If you have enjoyed today's short video, make sure that you leave a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and make sure that you also check out Riley's channel where she's going to be showing you her day in the life through a little bit of a vlog. Till next time guys, bye.